Hello, this is Jun Matsumoto. I'm a specialist of ACL natural healing and also the inventor of Evo Devo exercises. Evo Devo exercises mean evolutionary and developmental exercises. Have you ever heard about the word evolution? Maybe you have learned uh, the theory of evolution in your high school or junior high school class. Do you know that our first ancestor? Our first ancestor as vertebrates is fish. But do you know the ancestor before becoming fish? If you are familiar, if you like biology, you may know our first ancestor is just a single cell in the sea. Our evolution started from single cell in the sea. This single cell becomes, became multi cells, multi cells. Then Multi cells became jellyfish like creatures. Then, jellyfish like creatures became fish. They are our first ancestors as vertebrates. Then, fish became amphibia. Amphibia became, became mammals. The mammals became ape monkeys, then monkeys became homo sapiens, you know, we are homo sapiens. This history is called evolution of human beings. This evolution uh, continue, you know, appear again when our life began. Our mother's egg, our father's sperm, sperm you know, get together and become embryo, embryo, which is single cell. Our private life starts from single cell, which is embryo. Then embryo is divided into multi cells. Then multi cells become organ. No? Organ becomes like such as muscles, bone, brain, you know, heart. So evolution uh, starts, you know, our life when our life starts during your baby days when we are born from our mothers. We start from the movement of fish, you know, fish. We can't walk, you know, just after we are born. Starting from the movement of the fish, which is a rolling, you know, rolling rotational movement, just shaking the spine. Those are the movement of the fish. Then we start to do the moving forward by slithering, slithering, which is the movement of the amphibia. You know, we follow the movement of our ancestors. Then, few months later, uh, from our birth, we do crawling. That's the movement of the mammals. You know? Mammals like cat, lion, dog, our ancestors. We do crawling imitate the movements of mama. Then, finally, we stand up uh, by pedal walking, you know. Even after our birth, we followed evolution of the movement of our ancestor, you know. Our history of our ancestor evolution, our ancestor's evolution, and our Evolution, you know, after the birth, those are similar, you know. We continue 
uh, we redo the evolution after the birth. This is called the recapitulation theory. This is called recapitulation theory. Uh, also, uh, this is my idea, new theory. After the injury, evolution also happens. After we cut the skin muscles, our body uh, start to have, you know, stem cells, stem cells, stem cells become multi cells, multi cells become the muscle. Let's talk about ACL. When ACL is torn, our body start to have start to send stem cell which is the you know do you remember the evolution of our ancestors and our ancestors our life start from single cell even after the injury uh, evolution happens continues until we die then also let's say in this way uh, when we turn ACL we lose the function of the knee. We lose, you know, we can't run, right? After ACL tear, we lose the function of the knee. What should we do? In the evolution theory, in the Evodevo exercises theory, we should start from the movement of our first ancestors. You know, we should start from the movement of the fish, even after the injury of ACL. Always start from the beginning. That's why this is the significance of doing Evodevo exercises. In the Western medicine, I don't want to criticize Western medicine. Uh, they, doctors, therapists, focus on the function, only the knee. They try to recover the range of motion. They try to strengthen the muscle. They only see this element part. No, 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 that's not true. After the injury, evolution also continue. We, we should start from the beginning. When we get hurt, injured, knee, we should start from the movement of the fish. No? movement of the spine you know fish don't have the arms legs they only have fins and the spine we should learn the movement of the spine then we do uh, we should do the movement of the amphibia amphibia you know in the evolution exercises uh, we do the movement called slithering movement of the amphibian. We learn how to move the leg and the shoulder by doing the slithering. Then we do movement of crawling, which is the movement of the mammals. Then we are prepared, we should be prepared until we start standing by bipedal or walking, running. We should not start from walking after injury. We should start from the beginning. You know? we, should we should follow the history of evolution. Even after we injure. This is very inter interesting, right? So why don't you start Evo Devo exercises from now? Even though you are not injured, it is worth doing ever-ever exercises. Thanks for watching. See you again.